I've seen the symbol on this key before. I got a founder's key. Is it supposed to cut off like that? Hmm. I remember seeing it in the town hall when I was a kid. I can't remember where in the building, though. Well, I guess we'll go check out the friggin' town hall. I don't think it's that far. I think it's, like, right there. Yeah, okay. We're really close, actually. Is there a place to save? I would like to save, because I got really nervous that the game was going to crash on that last loading screen. Okay. <clears throat> so, yeah. No, uh, no health items, no ammunition. But, uh, totally fine. We're doing, we're doing great. Was it just me, or was she, she was a pretty tough boss, compared to, uh, the first one, but then again, that was the first one. She just took a long time to go down. I didn't understand why she took so many hits. But she took a lot of hits. Like, a lot. So now that we're out here, let's, uh, go around the alleyway. Oh, okay. Never mind. I didn't want to do that anyway. Oh, hi, you guys! It's the Hammerhead dudes again. Thinking they special. Give me a break. Okay, here's the town hall. Oh, we, we have the key to get in now, right? What is this thing? Just thought I'd check it. Oh, okay. Can't check it. That's cool. Let's get inside before we get murdered. What do you mean? Oh. You can just open it up. I didn't realize that. Apparently there's a save point in here, which is the first save point in the game. But it's easily skipped because you don't really know to go in here. Oh my god, can we please just... Thanks, see ya. Anything good in here? This is my great 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 grandfather, Isaac Shepard. Can he come in here? It sounds like he's trying to figure out how, but he's not able to. Probably because he's dumb, right? I'm sorry, is there anything in here? Is there a reason why I... I was kind of hoping for like a health drink or something? Look at him, just standing out there fogging up the place. What's the big idea? Cool, so this was a useless endeavor. This was dumb. Can I... This is horrible. Hey man, come in. It's great in here. I'm gonna lock you in here, you know. I figured out your weakness. You can't open doors. I mean, how could you? You don't have any... You don't have any limbs. Okay, how can I, can I close it? Nope. All right. Cause that makes sense. How come some doors close when you move through them and others don't? It's upsetting. Hey, this is where the key goes. Mom and Judge Holloway talking in our house. Yes. They're great friends, I'm sure. The history of Shepherd's Glen is one of opportunity and enterprise. First settled nearly a century and a half ago, its founders came here as pilgrims, searching for a new home to practice their faith and ensure the prosperity of their four families. It soon flourished into a thriving small town. Shops and businesses sprung up on what is now Main Street. The turn of the century brought tourists eager to explore the region's lakes and rivers, and with tourists came more business. In the 1950s, many of the original municipal buildings, such as the town hall and the library, were restored. The 1990s encouraged further investment, modernizing uh, Shepherd's Glen as it headed into the new millennium. 
but throughout its success, Shepherd's Glen has always managed to remain a close-knit community, maintaining the same ideals on which it was founded. One can only hope that the founding families would be proud if they saw the town as it is today. What a great history. That was very detailed. You really did your research. Don't let there be one over here, please. Okay, we went back here. Good. I just wanted to check, that's all. No more smogs. Hmm. Something? Is there, uh... Is there something? This looks like... Look at this. Look at this. This looks like a first aid kit or something. Or a serum? It's serum. Oh, thank God. I hope I, I hope I can find all the serum. That'd be good. How are we doing right now? We're not doing great. However, I don't want to use the serum just yet. I feel like there'd be a better opportunity for that. Probably later. Oh, does it connect in the back? Hang on a second. Sorry, I had to sneeze. I'll edit that out, though. You will never hear my sneeze. Let's save. Well, it doesn't look like there's anything else in here. Just a save point. Hey, you idiot. See you later. Oh, okay, so this was all that was in this hallway? That's upsetting. Well, then let's go in this back door, then, I guess. Health drinks, please. Please, health drinks. I'm just looking around for health drink. That's, that, that's really all I care about finding. Oh, there's nothing back here. Are you kidding me? Uh, I guess I gotta go use that key, then. That's disappointing. Why so many rooms with nothing in them? I mean, there was some serum and then there was a save point. And that's pretty much all that was in here. Sure, let's go down there. Sounds like there are things in here. Okay, so it looks like... Oh, nurses! All right, sure. What? Why isn't he doing... Ow! All right, they're mad right now. I understand. I understand that you're angry. He's not doing his combos. I don't understand. Like he's not doing him. He's not doing the combos on them. Uh, I can only get him to slash twice. I have no idea why. This book looks ancient. The pages are all tattered. I can barely read the text. To continue on the path we have laid before us, it is vital that the people remember the road traveled. We must continually provide, update, and nurture accurate records of the past that cannot be challenged by outsiders. Funny that this uh, obsession with <laughs> nurturing and updating the past is in Silent Hill Homecoming. Eh. 
Once the lore has been handed over, the Keeper shall confine himself to an uncorrupted sanctuary. There he shall learn the history of the Founders. In God's name, so shall it be. Maybe this was like the initial brief for the <laughs> development of the game. This actually isn't, has nothing to do with the cult at all. In defense of the tenants, it is necessary that one person preside over the punishment of any members who have fallen from the path, aka Judge Holloway, I'm sure. These rulings must be based on complete understanding of the laws set forth and must be executed without prejudice. The executor of the law must not waive in the responsibility of enacting this power. He must declare his oath in public forum to uphold the ideals of the book. In God's name, so shall it be. You guys, these people are crazy. I got the ceremonial dagger slash doorknob. Wait, I don't have my knife anymore? Ooh, it's a little faster, I think. Yeah, it's a little quicker. A little quicker on the draw, I like that. With the truth of the old believers fractured, it is essential that one person maintain and effectuate the modern secretarian Sorry, sectarian rights we have toiled so faithfully to create and protect. After taking up the mantle of this post, the performer of rites shall make a pilgrimage to the edge of the forsaken region to purify himself from the sins of the past. There he will beseech the forefathers for forgiveness and understanding. In God's name, so shall it be. So we've got the executor of the law and the performer of rites. In the pursuit of creating a more perfect way, rules must be followed and rules must be enforced. Any member who ignores this command shall be dealt with swiftly and in view of all. This shall ensure continued prosperity. It is therefore imperative that the effective master of arms not waive in the responsibility of enacting this power until his last day in this life. In God's name, so shall it be. So master of arms, I'm guessing that's Curtis. And based on what we saw in the basement, the performer of rights was uh, his dad. Hmm. Hmm. I guess we're done in here, right? Because we have uh, the tools necessary to enter different places in Alex's home. I'm just guessing. It seems like the whole thing was to get the ceremonial dagger or whatever this thing is. Yeah. So we can go into that old room. Oh my god! Leave me alone! No. Alright. Party at my place. Everybody go. It'll be so great there. Wow, these dogs do not let up. It's upsetting. Can I go in here now? Uh, looks like no. You... Holy shit! Oh my god! Ridiculous! So, where, where to go? I don't understand. Oh! I didn't even see that!
Wow, I feel like an idiot now. Although, to be fair, how was I supposed to know? Hello? Anyone around? Seems like a labyrinth down here. Okay. Okay. Following the left wall, in case you couldn't tell. I decided we're not gonna get lost here. Ah, oh, okay. Hmm. Looks like we found something. That we can't interact with, okay. Can't go down there because there's a grate in the way. So I guess we just go up here. Okay, thanks. I guess. That was a very lengthy loading screen. I got a child's drawing. I still don't know how he does that pixelated style. That's crazy. So we're back in the cemetery. Oh, we're back here. Well, excuse me. We got a smog over there. Ooh, let's go in here. Sounds like a great idea. Collectibles or something. Yes! That looks like serum to me. It is. It's all smoggy for some reason. I guess he's standing right next to it, maybe? Alright, see you later. I'm impressed that we've uh, recovered all of those. Let's see. Okay, we do need to go this way, I guess. I do know that I want to use that fire axe on that one, uh, one area. Oh my god! No, thank you. What is going on back here? What? I've never been here before. This is new. I'm done though. Totally done. Thanks so much for stopping by. Where are we? Hey, idiot. Dumb face. See ya. Oh, okay, here we go. That was what I missed. Oh, hey! Oh my gosh! These guys are everywhere! Bye-bye! I believe there's a fire axe door way back here. I believe it's right there. Yeah, we want to go in there. Some goodies, probably. And then we're gonna go back to the house where we're gonna unravel more goodies. I got the chrome hammer pistol. Well, all of a sudden it replaced my old one. I don't recognize this name. Hmm. Oh, okay. Well, forget that then. I mean, we got a, a new, quote, new pistol. Give me a break. All right. You know what? Oh, no, it's locked now. I was gonna say I didn't fully explore that area earlier. 
But I guess it's too late now. What do you want? Should we use the serum now? Why not? I'm so good. I'm so healthy. You don't know me. Oh, get, give it a rest. This is a place of rest. It's the perfect place to give it a rest. All right, let's leave. Let's go through the backyard and actually get some stuff done inside the house. Now, where's Alex's dog? That's what I want to know. We see all these other ruffians, all these strays, but, you know, where's the family dog? Right? Sorry guys, got a lot of loading screens to get through. Finally! I want to know what's behind this door. Hopefully something cooler than a different pistol. I really just want serums at this point. That's really all I want. Uh, okay. Hey look, she uh, set uh, the uh, table. Looks like mom made a big dinner. Mom said these dishes were a, re a wedding present from grandma. <gasps> oh, it was a first aid kit. I thought it was another serum. I was getting very excited. But I guess not. Womp womp. Are you serious? Huh, looks like that's it. Uh, great. So what do we do? How are we supposed to get to the basement then? We gotta get to the basement, dude. All right, we go through the backyard. I'm a dummy. So all that was in there was a first aid kit? Man, I've been thinking about that room all game long. As soon as I got the fire axe, I was like, oh cool, now I can open up that room in the house. Well, too bad. Dude, maybe remove the hose from the basement? I don't know, just a hunch. Seems like that might be what's flooding the place. Okay. Let's uh, do this, I guess. Should we even go check on mom? I don't know if there's much of a point. I got the attic key. Really? Oh! I got the blue steel shotgun! Oh, that's right. It came with rounds in it. It came with rounds, you guys. Unlike that crappy handgun. Didn't come with anything. So looks like we got some wine bottles in here. A crate. A bloody shower with no shower head. Oh, it's just a drain. It's not a shower. This is like his saw room. I see. Little weird torture chamber area. Alright, we're uncovering some secrets. Time to unlock some other places in the house. Other areas. I hope you guys are excited. Hey, Mom. Hey. I don't know anything else, Alex. I'm sorry. So nothing else? Okay. Nothing else for you to tell her, Alex? Seems like we've experienced quite a lot together. Are you saying that means nothing? I'm kind of hurt, man. Kind of hurt. I see. 
This is the attic. Doesn't make much sense. I'm guessing this is Dad's room. These are Dad's books. He always got so worked up if I touched any of his stuff. Uh-huh. This is the same TV my parents had when I left. Oh man, remember black and white TVs? Holy shit. You guys. TVs used to not have color. Like when I was a kid, we had a black and white TV. No one has a black and white TV anymore. Like, no one. Something I didn't even think about. Because, like, you think about uh, old CRT monitors compared to flat screens today, and you think, wow, how archaic, but... I mean, I don't know, maybe it's just because we weren't very well off, but we had a black and white TV. And, like, it, it kind of got tricky, because I couldn't always tell when I was watching a black and white... <laughs> film or if it was in color because it, it just looked exactly the same you could kind of tell though like there were uh, the grays were stronger usually in color mm. films hey this is me what am I doing I'm not gonna say the first thing that came to mind because it's way too easy but I think you guys can figure it out it's just too easy so what I get that, uh, I'm sorry, what am I supposed to be doing up here? Something here. It looks like we got to push this out of the way. Dude, you clearly push this out. There's a doorway right there. Can't believe I had to point that out to you before you did it. I have something very important I want to show you. Okay. Do you know what this is? This belonged to your grandpa and his father too. And now we want you to have it. I know it doesn't look like much, but this is the most important thing I could ever give to you. Is it worth a million dollars? Much more than that. This is a symbol of our family's past and our future. Joshua, you are never to show anybody this ring. Not even Alex. But I, I want to show Alex. Do you remember when I told you sometimes you must do things and not ask why? Well, this is one of those times. Yes, sir! That's my boy. We get it. You all hate Alex for some reason. Jeez. What is wrong with all of you? What's this? Wow, okay. Somebody's yelling. Certificate of release or discharge from active duty. Name, Shepard, Adam J, rank, Colonel, pay grade, 06, date of birth. 1954, April 18th. Place of entry into active duty, Fort Benning, Georgia. Last duty assignment in major command. Uh, 18th Airborne Corps. Station where separated. Fort Bragg, North Carolina. Decorations, medals, badges, and campaign ribbons. Awarded or authorized. <laughs> awarded or. <laughs> it's all one word. Oh, sorry, I'm not done yelling. <clears throat> Good Conduct Award. Purple Heart. Silver Star. Military Education. Basic Parachute. Turing. Air Assault Curse. Us Mill Command. And Staff College. Type of separation. Release from active duty. Character of service. Honorable. Narrative reason for separation. Retirement. I hereby certify that the attached document is a true and accurate record to the best of my knowledge. Signed, Adam J. Shepard. Sorry for the dramatic reading, everybody. It just, it was in all caps. I had to. What? What are you doing? No. No. Dude, this is exactly like the Resident Evil 4 puzzle. This is the same puzzle! Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I can't fucking believe it. 
<laughs> Good lord, look at this thing. Okay, um... Clearly, uh... Well... <laughs> I know where things are supposed to go, clearly. It's just that these are two. Ugh, that's annoying. I think if I've thought enough moves ahead, I've got it. I really got myself in trouble there, but... Hmm... Aha! I think I got it. I'm like 99% sure that this is it. Oh, thank God. I think this is it. I really screwed myself up there for a while, but I think I finally got out of it. Yes! This is it. Oh, good. I did it! Finally! Oh my God, it's a letter from Dad. I have failed and they know it. They blame me. They should. I swore to protect this town, but I can't. The streets decay before our very eyes. The curse we always feared has come upon us. Worse yet, the order has returned, kidnapping and killing with impunity, brainwashing those they take in an effort to rebuild their flock. Whether they want to punish us for the exodus of our forefathers, or simply to breathe new life into the old ways, I don't know. But they've taken our people. The only thing left is to face the source of this evil, to fight it, and pray that some hope can be restored. My sole consolation is that I finally opened my eyes to the evil in Silent Hill. I got a letter from my father. There's something else here. It looks like a map of Silent Hill. Did he go there? I need to ask Mom if she knows about this. I got the map of Silent Hill. Okay, not gonna lie, this... Seems a little off story-wise, but hey. Oh, that's uh that's a Silent Hill map. Yeah, for sure. What was with that puzzle? Oh my god, that was horrible. Finally done with it though. Jeez. Oh man. But yeah, that was almost the exact same like, uh, symbol, as in, uh, Resident Evil 4. I mean, it just, it seems like too much of a coincidence, but anyway. Listen to me, Mom. Start telling me everything you know about this. I don't know what that is. Stop lying! I'm tired of it! I know all about Silent Hill. You don't know anything about Silent Hill. I... I know Dad went there. He went to go fight something. Did he go to get Joshua? Is that where Josh is? God damn it, tell me! Oh, Alex. I'm so sorry. Stop pretending you care about me! Start telling me what's going on! Oh shit, look behind Josh you, dude. Josh was the only one you ever cared about. And I can help him, if you tell me the truth.